Ooh -wee. It's fall time, baby. Anyway, um, I I do have a new hoodie. Just, just like, you know, we got we got the whole ghost face thing going on. Um, but anyway. Hey there guys, how are you guys doing today? Welcome into another episode of Fallout London where today we're doing, I don't know, just more stuff for um, the Vagabonds. Uh, it's been a while since I've actually sat down and recorded Fallout, so I can't remember everything that we've done. But, um, firstly, I do want to say thank you to everyone who watched the vlog from last week. I think I'll put a screenshot of it here somewhere. Um, and also that one could be down below as well. But today we are focusing on Fallout. Sorry I've not uploaded Fallout in like, what, two weeks? A week? Two weeks. I think it's been two weeks since I uh, uploaded Fallout. So uh, yeah, that's what today's video is. Um, we're also trying something new. We're going to try uploading on a Friday instead. Um, just because it gives me more time to like uh think stuff through and all that but anyway let's kind of just uh jump straight in and go into this one miter because i think we have to talk to i can't remember who we need to talk to actually might be just you bet oh no it's we just need to talk to Nelson. Okay. Hello, young plum. Hello, mate. God has asked me to kill a syndicate enforcer, Captain. Can you give me any help? Help? I can't help with that. Can't even see enough to help you. Ha <laughs> ha. You got to do this on your own. No handholding. But I'll give you a bit of background so you know what you're in for. Okay. The Syndicate has an enforcement division known by locals as the Sniffers. All right. Their whole job is to keep the peace, as they call it, meaning meeting out a bit of the old ultraviolence against anything they consider subversive. Pretty cruel bunch, by all accounts. They tend to wander around in small groups around Millwall, looking for trouble. You'll find a few around Tower Hamlets and the Dome, too. Each group has a captain, and they're usually smart and tough. All right. You want to get that pin off their collar, you got to be smarter and tougher. And they ain't the complacent type, so don't expect no shortcuts here. Right. Like I said, no hand-holding on this one. You're on your own, I'm afraid. Do please try not to die. Uh, I guess I'll try. I, I guess for you, Nelson, I'll, I'll try. Okay? Right. Anyway, let's get going towards Millwall land. Um, I'll go and double check that it's on the actual pit boy as well. If again it wants to load. Right, let's uh open up the pit boy. Let's go to data. Oh wait, I've got a level up. Oh, we got a level up. Oh hell yeah, did. You know what? I think I'm going to put a bit into agility. Yeah, let's put a bit into agility. So, Millwall, yeah? Is it just not giving us any sort of... There's no one. Is Millwall on this side? I can't remember, honestly. Uh, so yeah, okay. Uh, okay. All right, I guess we'll just kind of try and find them on the way. Because I have no clue where I am. I think I'm in Thameshaven. Um, so, I guess. Oh, that's a lot of glitchy, glitchy lighting going on over there. Let's go have a look at what this is. Sure, why not? 
Oh wait, you said the dorm as well, didn't you? Oh, that's that's rad. Oops. Oopsie. Okay, we we're in the glades now. That's sick. Whoa, love that. Oh, that's not that. How do I do that again? I. Oh, that's all. What? Cute. Cute. Okay, no, you're friendly. You're friendly. Y'all are friendly. Hello, Asmo. Looking for some quality protection. Look no further. I see what you've got then, Asmo. Eh? Got plenty of stock. Take your pick. Ah, well, indeed. Ah, well, indeed. If there's anything. You got no weapons though. So, it's not a great start. Coastal armor. How much? 158 tickets. Honestly, it might be a shout. Might be a shout. Oh, or I could have got the Bill Trapper armor. Ah, uh, you know what? We'll, we'll do that then. Because I think I've got a few things I can sell you as well, mate. So. Unluckily for you, we we can basically get this for free. So, uh, I'll keep... One of each thing, I guess. Here, have that. I have one of them. Uh. Now, nah, probably use. Yep, that'll do it. Let's see what else I can sell you. That. Uh, cat. Do you want a football kit? Formal app? Hogan stuff? Do you want some Jack Tar uniforms? Do you? You can get two of my tricorns, you're not getting all of them. You can get that too. You can get that too. Uh, I've probably got some misc stuff I can sell you. Uh, that'll do. Fuck it. Fuck it, that'll do. Okay. Uh, tab. Thank you. Let's uh, go try all this new armor we just got on. Because that's what I want to do. Right? You guys good with that? Cool. Good. Glad you're good with that. Let's see what this trapper uniform looks like. Oh, that's kind of sick though. That kind of goes hard. I need the right arm, but like, that kind of goes hard, honestly. Uh, let me go and look at the other thing, because overall right now I've got 46 armor. Uh, coastal armor is 21. Let me see what the coastal armor looks like. Oh wait, the coastal armor kind of goes hard, dude. That's kind of sick. Honestly. You know what? For now, until we get that left or right arm. I think it was left arm. Uh, we'll, we'll keep with the coastal armor for now unless it gets like... Really bad. Oh, crude revolver. Anything through here? Hello. Oh, I keep pressing the wrong buttons, man. Dead. Okay. Oh, that's a lot. That's a lot of people. 
Come out here. Come on. Right here, baby girl. Come here. Yeah. Woo! 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 Ah! Uh, I I need stem packs. Wait, right now. Or squirrel bits. That 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 also works. Let's have a bit of... Um, more squirrel bits. And like some sugar. Some potatoes out there. All right, come here. Hmm. How am I going to get these? Okay, right, okay. I think I've got an idea. We have an idea. There is a plan. I have a plan, okay? Just don't even worry about it. Need those. Where's the revolver? Oh, that does like nothing, dude. Oh. Ah! Haha. <laughs> Haha. <laughs> Yeah, I was meaning this more for the the turret, but Oh, I think it's just the turrets just hitting me slowly. Come on, a few more. grenades on PC. Thank you. Give you the tea bag, okay. Oh, I am not accurate at all with this. All right, come here. I'm not dead, mate. What are y'all gonna do? Oh, it's cute that y'all thought that you were gonna kill me. Anyway. Ooh, some hypo. And some radaway. Cool. You know what? You two can stay up there because I can't be bothered walking all the way over there. Right, this definitely isn't Millwall. So I'm gonna have a look around. But I have a feeling that Millwall's more up this side. Hmm. 
right? Let's go to Beef Eater. Just see if it's right up there. Oh, oh. Hmm. 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 I don't know. I don't know if... Um... What is it? I, I don't know where these uh, enforcers are. That uh, looks like some enforcers. Popping off, we popping off, we popping off. Oh wait, sniffer. Aha. Aha, I got one. Yes. See? See? I'm a genius. I knew going up here would help. I am going to fast travel back though. Just because. Just because I don't want to die, you know. Not that I would, but actually, no, yeah, I would. That's also a pretty far trek as well. And I think that would be pretty boring for you guys just watching me walk around, you know. I just want to get more of this um, thingy done. Uh, this uh, quest thing. Uh, I'm also going to heal. Actually, wait. Can I not... I can get uh, Yvette to heal me up as well, can't I? So... <laughs> I'm going to be smart and not waste my resources. So, <laughs> I'm funny. I'm good at what I do. You know? Right. Sorry, gone. I gotta find your vet first. Oh, perfect. Need help? Ah, uh, I need medical assistance. Where Bad are you injured. Okay? I don't care about the radiation stuff because I've got plenty right away okay. anyway. Thank you. How goes the hunt? Well, mate, uh, it's done. Here's the pin. Oh my god, just let me talk to well, you. Well, well. I wasn't sure you had it in you, me old China. Very what do you well done indeed. Eh? And good riddance to the dirty dog you scrubbed to get this. Here, keep this pin. Your first trophy is something to hold on to with pride. And take these threads. You're one of us now. So you ought to dress the part too. Welcome to the Vagabonds. Thank you, God. Now, I told you I had some big plans coming up. Come see me and the boys in the lounge and I'll tell you what comes next. Oh? It's time for those dogs to find out what happens when we bite back. Okay. Didn't your mum teach okay, you? I'm going to wear that hat because specifically I want to wear that hat. And also, it's a legendary. Gives Better. me two off. Okay, I, I'm immediately regretting this. Okay, this looks funny. But anyway. We need the numbers. Where is he? Oh. Hey, gone. We used to be something, but now. It's a good day to get things done. Okay, well, get a move on. Going. Can't move on. Get to move on. Get to move shot on. Done, never hurt anything. Uh huh. Really? Maybe I should put the sword away, huh? <laughs> Maybe. 
Just slightly. Maybe. Maybe a little bit. I don't know, though. Well, here we all are, then. Yes, here Listen, we are. Lads, I've called us together for a reason. The dogs hit us hard last time. Coming right. right to the center of our turf. Well, I didn't want no rash response. But now our heads have cooled. It's time we looked at how to bite back. The dogs all right. are trying to get the nuclear reactor on their turf up and... One sec, I'm going to turn the subtitles off because I want to... Escape. Running. We've got to win this war before that, that reactor could produce double the power Battersea can. The oh. gentry would have the tummies in their gaff in seconds. They'd be untouchable. So now's the time to strike. And strike hard. All right. And we've got us some extra help now. The lab rats we found down bridge is moving up in the world. This wayfarer is now a vagabond. Nice oh, yeah. one. Good work, mate. Thank Get you. In. You've had a taste of syndicate blood, wayfarer. I'm hoping you're hungry for more. I mean, did you not watch the last episode? Phase in the war. Like, I, I killed so many of them, active. did. And I want you as our new commando. If we're making war plans, shouldn't why Nelson be here for this? The old man's keeping his neck out of this one. He thinks we should keep our heads low and stay out of trouble. Oh, all right, okay. And I've had enough of that. No more defensive maneuvers. Okay. No more shit house posturing. It's time to give the syndicate what they deserve. Let's and do it, if that man. Means escalating the fight. Then I say, bring it the fuck on. Let's bring it the fuck on, eh? What do you mean by a commando, man? You've eh? shown you're good on your feet in a tight spot. What do you mean? And you've shown you can carry out raids in enemy territory, and you can keep yourself alive doing so. That's exactly what we all, but need for some sure. new aggressive assaults on the syndicate. All right. Sounds good. What's my first mission? That's what I've got the lads here for. Chill, bullet tooth, shrapnel. I told you all I want new plans for how we can do some proper damage to the dogs. And new blood here is going to be our point person. What you got for me? If you hang around, what's not none? All right. The numbers. So I just have to do missions for all of these guys now. Is that it? Guns is what we need, boss. Syndicate always have more than us. Way more. We can't win a war without enough weapons. Syndicate get regular supplies from the gentry factories. Right. I know of a depot they run in a warehouse by West India Key. Okay. I say we break in there and clean it out. You must be joking. Security will be tighter than a rat's arse there. I'd have to send a whole team in to get more than a handful of guns. It's too dicey by half. I know a gal that might be able to help us. An old, uh, associate. Associate, she yeah? She could find a way past the systems there. At least long enough to shift some crates out. We just need someone to break in and open the loading bay from the inside. No, this is just stupid. Get your fucking brain in gear. I want to hurt the dogs, not do some petty theft. Anything we nick, they just replace in a week. We'd be better off burning the place down. Destroy whatever's there. Fancy security and all, and fuck up their supply operations all right. for months. Wouldn't even take much explosives to fry a weapons dump. You're cool, boss. But there's bound to be some lovely gear in there. Would be a crying shame to see it all go to waste. I'll if try to pick up what I can. Down, then there's no harm in having some guns while Serati is there. Okay, sure, but that's just some frosting. The real aim here is to fuck over the syndicate. You've been paying attention, Wayfarer. You want me to break into the syndicate warehouse, grab some guns, then burn it to the ground? Good. Take these charges. Find a way into this warehouse and set them somewhere that'll cook extra crisp. 
and take this old card of mine and go see Frosty Valentina. She runs a bakery these days near Millwall High Street. She should recognize the card from our old days. Right. I'd go see her myself, but the syndicate sniffers would kill me on sight. Tell her what you're about, and she can sort you with something to bypass the security systems. Waste of time. We don't need this Millwall beat. Hey, no need to talk about Valentina like that. Fine. I just want the fucking job done. No All right. distractions. So. Right, well, we'll just pick up all of them. What does the syndicate have in abundance that we don't? Reptiles, herpes. Literally everything. No, no, no. I mean, yeah, probably. But I'm thinking of one thing in particular. What? Supplies. While we're choking down squirrel stew and using rock gut whiskey to treat anything from the flu to a bullet in the head, the IODS has enough food and medicine to supply both them and the whole of Westminster. Yeah. I feel it's high time we alleviate them of some of that excess and put ourselves uh, in I a think we should to succeed. Do that. After all, health is wealth. So what are you suggesting we do about it? And if you say a train robbery again, I swear to God. Well, now, just hear me out. There's a train that makes up a third of the syndicate supply line, and... Oh, for fuck's sake, Winston. Oh. You've been reading your bloody spy comic books again. You're not... Double O Six or whatever. Give it a rest. Double O Six. Well, it's Double O Five actually, and what I read in my spare time is nothing. Double O Five, not Double O Seven. Damn. Okay. Issue is anyway. They have supplies. They transport them via train. We rob the train. It's simple. It's not bloody simple. Pull the train it's up. Never bloody simple. There are far too many variables at play in a job like that. Could be another lab rat, you know. The skin of our bollocks on the supply run to the lab. And you want to up the ante? Not a chance. Out of the question. That's just it, though, innit? You're looking at the ones and zeros of the returns from the lab. But the real intangible score of that job run is staring us right in the bloody face. What are you on about? It's got a pipe. With the wayfarer. Hmm. Not a bad point. All right, fine. Here's what we'll do. Let's send the wayfarer right. to strap on a tux and play international spy. And if they don't come back, we're only back to net zero on that lab run. Happy? Seems like the more people we send, the better chance of success we'd have. But, yeah, sure. I'll take what I can get. Good. You should be thanking me for even agreeing to that. Right. The stakes of a job like this are still sky high. Seeing as if the wayfarer fucks this up, the heat comes down on our heads like a red coach deli belly. You hear that, wayfarer? If you muck this I up hear and get you. yourself killed, I'll find you in the afterlife and shit down your throat for the rest of eternity. Kinky, you promise? Very encouraging. So, what exactly am I doing? Excellent. So the train passes through Poplar Station. That's where you'll be heading first. The station is a syndicate outpost, right. so you'll most likely have to put down some dogs to get to the control room. Okay. Once you're there, all no you have to do is that. switch the train route to Canning Town Station. Hop aboard, and Bob's your uncle, you're done. All right. We'll be waiting in Canning Town to unload the supplies. Easy peasy. Yeah, I'm sure it'll be just that simple. It will be. Wrong. It's only the syndicate's most important and highly guarded assets we're talking about. Yeah, it's on. So in yeah. case it's not the sunny stroll uh, in the park, that that's like a white day for me, though. Take these explosives. If we can't, I'm just getting supplies, a lot of explosives, no haven't I? Can. Get me. If things start going south, blow that train to kingdom come. Right. Even if we come away empty-handed, at least we'll muck up the syndicate's main supply lines. Okay. But securing those supplies is still the main objective, so don't go blowing them up for the hell of it. Any questions? No, sir. What's Medicine, the wall, talking other about? finished goods and the like. But most importantly, anything you've been craving while licking the lid of a tin of dog food, they've got it in that train. Bangers and mash, eggs and rashers, proper baked beans, fish and chips, steaks as thick as a phone book. They've got it all. You pull this job off, and we'll quite literally be eating like royalty. Right. 
Uh, well, let's Good do luck, this. Mate. The lads will see you in Cannon Town. Quick, take this before Gaunt sees. Oh, -ho! we just got. Oh, that's a pistol and a half, buddy. Woo! Christ, this is such a mistake. I'll be finding. All right, Shrap, now what you got for me? I've got an easy aspiration, boss. I say we tear down the dredge. The mud shoot prison boat. What do you mean, take it down? We crack it open and steal the yoke. There's a bunch of our blokes in there. Lab right here can sneak in, let everyone out, then set a few well-placed bombs to sink the whole damn place. I ever tell you you're a fucking lunatic, Johnny? You've mentioned it a few times, boss, but, uh... What exactly I mean, is it about this that seems so mad? The dredge yep. is guarded to the tits. You couldn't sneak a gnat's fart in there. And what's the good in blowing it up? Syndicates have been trying to call us terrorists ever since we broke out that friend of events. If we bomb a, a prison, point. they'll just use that as propaganda against us. Yeah. Not everyone's fond of prisons gone. And our lot in there have some grit in a fight. Would be nice to have them back in our numbers rather than rotting in the clink. There's some logic in your lunacy, Shrapnel. We could do with more hands. And it would stick it to the dogs if we break our boys out of the dredge. Yep. All right. Tell our chum your plan, then. Aye. How can I get There's in? a gangplank from the shore near the front. And there's groups of guards patrolling all the time there. It's pretty tight, like the boss said. No one's ever gotten in by brute force. But a lone nutter, being all sneaky like, I reckon it could work if you're clever. You'll want to go at night, of course. Less patrols then. The door on the ship is locked, but it's no fancy if you know your way around some tumblers. Or you could try loot a key from the guard patrol, whilst not summoning all of Gehenna upon you. Should all be pretty easy in theory, right? This is fucking in madness, Johnny. Theory, I guess. Look, look to this. Uh, I can be quieter than an axe fart if I need to. I think we got the right nutter for the job. I. What do I do what, once I'm in there? Our kept in a block near the front, but you'll have to take down the security system before you spring them. The cells themselves are unlocked from the warden's office down the back of the ship. There's a bigger block in the middle you can open the same way, full of the gentry's convicts. It would be good to set the whole place free. And have them all shot as soon as they try to leave. Our boys can handle themselves, but the other numpties will just get slaughtered or recaptured and we'll get the blame for it. Maybe our nutter here could help take out some of the enforcers. No one deserves to rot in that place. And if we get the other prisoners out, we're free to set the bombs Nobody and do some permanent fucking damage. Again. Or end up with everyone sandwiched between explosions and syndicate enforcers. It would be a clusterfuck, Johnny. I mean, just focus on getting our own lot out. Them others aren't our problem. But the dredge, maybe it's too hard. But damn, I'd love to see that hellhole sink. All right, I think I've got it all figured out. Fan fucking tastic. Here, three bombs is enough to sink the ship if you get the chance to use them. They'll need placing around the lower deck. Once they're set, you'll need a scarper. Quick, good luck, mate. All right. Cool. Right. Well, I guess. Uh, what we are? We're at like 35 minutes. So yeah, we'll make this a shorter one. I know not a lot happened in this episode, but I am going to be recording again tomorrow for me, like two days ago for you guys, or even then. I... No, I'm recording this the same day I'm uploading it. Never mind. I know we didn't get a lot done. Um, I know we didn't get a lot done today, but I am going to be recording tomorrow. So, as well. So, hopefully, we should have another video out by Monday or possibly next Friday. We'll see how the week goes. I might just try and do every Friday instead of every Monday. But, anyway, with that being said, I hope you guys have a good rest of your day. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next episode, and yeah, peace out. Yoop!